Hey everybody, that brown bat back once again in ye old town with Black Widow for another episode of the Toy Box Rumble. And this Toy Box Rumble, we have Darth Vader teaming up with Boba Fett going against the Incredible Hulk. Two against one. Will they succeed or will the, the Incredible Hulk dominate? Black Widow, do the honors. Here come the contestants. Where's Vader? There he is. Okay, they're going to play this again and just stand still and run at each other. Okay. Hulk counters. Vader. And goes crazy. All right. If Vader loses, or if Vader gets beat, Hulk gets 10 points. Boba Fett gets beat, Hulk gets 10 points. Hulk gets beat, of course, Vader's team gets 10 points. So, I guess it's a win-win for each team. However you want to look at it. If Hulk's able to beat both of those each at the same time, he'll get 20 points right off the bat, right? But they only have to deal with one opponent, so... I don't know how that's going to work out for Hulk, and I don't know how it's going to work out for Vader. I do know that Vader has the most hit points out of all the uh, boss characters. There goes Hulk with an elbow drop. And of course the super again. And Boba... Boba got beat. Alright, another Boba will be coming in shortly. There he comes. And that's 10 points, of course, for Hulk. And as far as hit points go, I think Hulk might be the second most hit points after Vader. Wow. Where, oh, there he is. I thought Vader disappeared. Okay. There goes the Hulk, so there's 10 points for Vader's team. And here comes another Hulk. Any hope that you may win. Yeah, I say that about hit points. I'm not sure, because we don't see the hit points up there. There's something else that could be a factor, and that's called armor. Or defense, which means that they would do uh, less damage if they had higher defense, so I don't know how they're created. Alright, so Hulk has beaten two Boba Fett's and one Vader. He has 30 points. And Hulk has only been beaten once. So it's 30 to 10 right now. This is easy to count if I'm not dealing with a whole army of... <laughs> a whole army, you know? Of anything. I like that you'll meet your destiny and Hulk destiny and Hulk's like, I don't think so. Smash! Release your anger. You underestimate. I don't do small talk. I am uninterested in letting you succeed. Vader down for the count. He's back up. Hulk didn't like that. But they're just gonna run at each other. Now they go. Yeah, Boba Fett has that his super attack that and he never pulls off. I, I've mentioned that before. It's it's just pathetic. Yeah, I totally wish all the boss characters would have been created as good as Grievous, Vader, and uh, Darth Maul. But it's kind of like they were in a hurry to get the uh, product out the door and just... All they did, really... If you notice the, uh... The Marvel boss characters... Well, even the Boba Fett one, he's Star Wars. 
But the ones from uh, Toy Box take over. If you notice, they your character will talk to them. That's the, and the, you'll, they'll also talk to your character too. That's because they have the same mechanics or the same programming as a power disc team up. That's why they'll actually follow you if there's no bad guys on the screen for them to fight. I mean, if you're on the same team, they'll follow you. And if you're not on the same team, they'll follow you too. That's, that's why they're always there attacking you, because they're programmed to follow you no matter where you go. Vader will stand in, like, one spot until you get in his vicinity. All right, so there goes a Vader, there goes a Hulk. So 50 to... 20, I want to say. Hulk's only been beaten twice. And Vader hacks away right at him, right? There I mean, he just... No escape. Yeah. I find your lack of sense Vader is relentless. Which is good. Or bad. Uh, take your pick. Right? Prepare but look at that. They just run in there. Du -du 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 -du. I'm so yourself. dumb. All right, let's entice him. Come on, hey Hulk. Do something. Do something. Break out of your dumminess. There. What is your business here? How's the smashing going, big guy? There is no escape. Prepare yourself. Insignificant compared to the power of the Force. There is no escape. This Move is toward chance. them. I have you now. I will end this quickly. Prepare They're totally yourself. stuck in stupidness. Come on. Over here. Follow me over here. You will be destroyed. There is no escape. Yeah, see how he he stands still. Alright, you got Boba Fett. Now get over here. There. AI, I tell ya. Sometimes it works really good, and other times they they don't. <laughs> I am uninterested in letting you succeed. Yeah, we got just over two minutes left. There's no way Vader can pull one off. Give in to your anger and strike me down. I think Hulk's gonna dominate. 60 points to what, 20? <laughs> Run in place again, guys. Run in place. Oh, there goes another Hulk. And that Boba Fett's almost done. If he attacks. Release your anger. Yep, there goes Boba Fett. Seventy points to what, thirty? Forty-five seconds left. You will meet your destiny. Release 
release your anger. At least Boba Fett's using his gun now. It's about time, right? No, nope. so much for the blaster. He's gonna start punching again. Oh, did he get Vader too? 80 points. Two, one, time. All right, Hulk has 80 points. Let's clear it and see what Vader got. 30, 80 to 30, Hulk dominates. Boba Fett, if Boba Fett actually fought better, they would have stood a chance. But Boba Fett didn't. And Hulk won. So until next time, this has been That Brown Bat and Natasha Romanoff. Thanks everyone for watching. If you enjoyed what you saw, give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps me out. And until next time, remember, keep on building.